Hi guys, so today I'm going to do my 36 week pregnancy update. I know it's a mess in the background. Um, I took the cot down and I've still got to put away the baby's clothes, which is like here. And um, yeah, just got last little bits to sort out. If you see me bouncing around, it's because I'm on an exercise ball. I'm currently actually 38 weeks pregnant. This video is extremely late, but I have wrote down my symptoms each week for you, so you know. So, 36 weeks, first thing to mention is that I have been hella thirsty. I've been drinking loads and loads of water. I think I've drunk my weight in water three times over each day. Um, really bad, um, like, first. I've been really thirsty for water in particular. I don't really want to drink anything else. And juice just seems to dehydrate me and makes me more thirsty. So I'm just sticking to water. It has been really hot, which is really like surprising for England. And that probably contributes to it. But really thirsty. Um, so yeah. The second thing to mention is that my insomnia has got worse. I don't know if you can see the state of me right now. <laughs> kind of staying back because I look awful. Um, I am waking up about five to six times a night. Our bathroom is downstairs. So I'm waking up, trudging down the stairs, going away, trudging back up the stairs. This is six times a night. I'm exhausted. Bearing in mind it takes me anything up to 10 minutes to get back to sleep. They always warn you after the baby comes, you're going to be shattered because of broken sleep. Well, I'm already getting up six times a night. I'm already shattered. I'm already getting broken sleep. I'll just wait till the baby's here. I don't have to wait till the baby's here. I already know. I'm already extremely tired. My baby has gotten huge. I... Over this last week, he seems to have just got massive. I don't know whether it's him piling on the fat, but he seems to be massive. He's always moving around. I can now tell which bits his bum, which bits his knee, and which bits are his shoulders and his back. Um, and I always wondered how women done that, how they could tell, but you do as they get bigger you're definitely like oh that's a bum get your feet out of my ribs sort of thing so you can tell and he is super super active he does not stop fidgeting he definitely takes after me he does he can't just sit still he has to be moving around which is quite reassuring because if he did suddenly stop moving i think i'd get worried because of He's very, very active. Um, another thing as well is the Braxton Hicks. They have intensified. They are quite tight when I get them now. Um, I wouldn't say painful, but I'd definitely say uncomfortable. I definitely notice them. And I sort of have to like stop, wait till it passes and then carry on because it's quite uncomfortable. I don't know how to describe it. It's like a tightening and a cramp and it's really uncomfortable. And I've been getting that a lot more. It sort of sometimes feels a bit like period pain. So it'll be tightening at the bottom. You'll feel like you've got that period pain feeling. It's not It's not good. The end of the third trimester has got to be like the most achy, painy, horrible just not pleasant it's not luxurious at all the fourth thing i'm reading it off of a list so if it seems a bit like choppy it's because i'm reading it from a list so the fourth thing is swollen feet and hands my god i look like heather trot off of eastenders if you've ever watched it I just feel like it's fat walking whale and my feet and my hands are just like, it's like I have, I've blown up a balloon 
stuck it on my feet and stuck a few toes on the end of it that's basically what my feet feel like and in the morning it's so bad I can't bend my foot I have to like walk around really weirdly like crab walking for the water retention water tension is that what causes it I think that's what causes it for the water to just I don't know what it does but after about 10 minutes of walking I can walk in the morning but other than that I'm walking like like a crab it's really uncomfortable and that's really about it I hope you enjoyed Bye.